Good day YouTube, baubles on a lot here. Prepare for the first test flight of the Easy Washer 2.0, which is a slightly strange designation, considering a first generation versus a second generation hand powered washing machine. They both have a uh, one to one direct drive manual hand crank. Second generation has a drain pipe and a valve on the bottom, and it doesn't have any internal baffles. Unlike the first generation. So, presumably, this is Easy Washer 2.0 to denote that this one is not direct drive it's something like 2.5 to 1 except in spin cycle mode when it's about five and a half to one and because the water has to be hand wrung out of these things it takes quite a lot of time and effort and water to rinse the soap out of them so the big theory is that although this easy washer 2.0 has a smaller washing drum which you're only allowed to half fill so i'm not expecting to be able to wash a full bucket of clothes i'm going to have to do that in two loads perhaps it might use less water and take less time owing to the fact that it's got a spin cycle on it. Who knows, time will tell. Okay, so that's the uh, bucket of clothes. So, this will take a bit of time. see how many half a drum of clothes is one shirt three t-shirts six socks two pairs of jocks equating to as i suspected about half a bucket we will see what we will see do not put more than half of the clothes into the roller the water level of water injection shall not be higher than one third of the drum which i'm going to take to be the ledge at the bottom of the drive roller and actually when you compare them side by side the plastic drums not actually that much smaller than the two previous drums the difference is that this one you got to leave half of it empty whereas these other ones you could pretty much fill them oh, three quarters four fifths the way up with clothes and then because they tumbled end over end over end that air space that clothes flop up and down backwards and forwards and that agitated the water and therefore it worked okay so let's see how much water is a third of a tub seems to be about seven or eight liters well, normally I would put 15 litres of water with one bucket of clothes for the initial soapiness. Add in some clothes washing detergent. Place the drum in the place. on the drum okay and the instructions do say insert the handle into the laundry hole and shake the handle clockwise for three to five minuets occasioning Well, I'll 
not keep on with this while saving the fuel. I think you're only the battery. I think you're only supposed to take this thing the one way. So I shall return. There we see the water level. You can see that some of the dirt from the clothes has worked its way into the plumbing. And it's really easy to turn once you get it going fast enough, but I suspect it requires a slightly slower speed for the agitation to actually be effective. And there's only just enough torsional strength in the handle to get it going from a still start. So I don't know what that's going to prove for the longevity of the device. But anyway. That's as much of the 7 litres as is going to come out. Yes, it will just hold itself. <coughs> no suggestion. Is to spin it at two and a half to one. which is certainly getting more water to come out. And then, shift the handle. As it said, you can expect it to vibrate. Let's hope it doesn't shake the roof off the hut. Spectacular. So it was. Okay. All right. Let's just see how much water you can hand wring out of them. Just about bloody nothing. So yeah, it works. Works real well. And now... Add in... A bit more water. I think that's about the right amount. And we'll go again. I think I'm going to like this machine.
Yes. So I think this is a good machine. certainly knows how to shake, I'll give it that. Go again. That's probably slightly a little bit too much water, but we'll see how we go. Again, very easy once you get it turning. This is a lot easier than the uh, previous methods. Slow spin. Mama. Okay. Yeah, it rates like a bastard, to be honest. Yes, well, it's going to have to come up to a slightly better 
mounting location than this one. But I would have to say it seems to be a success. Okay, here we go. Half a bucket of clothes washed in 20 litres of water in 55 minutes. So, I reckon for a first effort that's not bad. Uh, less than half the water. 40% of the water. And yeah, normally it'll do four hours for a full bucket. So less than an hour for half a bucket. I've got to say it's twice as fast and uses half the water. Congratulations, Easy Washer 2.0, instruction manual. Yeah, I like it. Quite a step up from the Wild Country Magic Wash. Light years ahead of the Bar Mix Presser Wash. And with all that hopping, skipping and jumping and carrying on and vibrating all over the shop, my high-tech Canadian 3D hand-operated printed Repairo didn't break. So I might seriously consider calling a halt to this video while I get on with washing the other half of the bucket of clothes. Warbles on a lot to YouTube. Ciao.